Hey everyone, let's clear a few things up. Your lessons are in Nearpod, just like all your other classes. In Microsoft Teams, you can find the code in the feed here. You can also find it in the assignments section up here. See? Pretty easy. But mister, I'm having trouble with Teams. No problem. Sunridge takes all of our Nearpod codes and conveniently puts them on the school website. No Microsoft Teams necessary. Just Google Sunridge Middle School. Once Google search takes you there, click the first link. And then you'll be on our website. Click Remote Learning Academy over here on the right side. It'll take you to a page where you select from your subjects, and from there you choose the weekly lesson plan. The password to see the code is the word generals. G-E-N-E-R-A-L-S, all lowercase. This page will show you all the Nearpod codes. Make sure you pick the right Nearpod code depending on your class period. Beginners, none of you are in 4th period, 7th period, or 8th period. Please, 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 please sign in with your first and last name. Each unit ends with an open-ended response, which Nearpod sends to us. If we want to give you credit for answering that question, we need your name. Each week's unit is designed to be done just a little bit at a time over the course of four days. The point is for you to play your instrument every day just a little bit. So each little video in the Nearpod unit is like your own personal mini band class. That's how it works. Hey, you see this slide that opens up every lesson? Do you notice this little bit at the bottom? You need to have your music separate from the YouTube lesson because you can't really read the music in the video and we don't always have your music on the screen. If you play clarinet and I'm showing you the trombone music, it doesn't work. That means you need to have your music in a separate place from the YouTube lesson. That's why it does say to print it out. The music can be downloaded in Teams right here. It can also be downloaded from Padlet here. I mean, we even put the Padlet into every single Nearpod. This is what your perfect setup would look like. Your printed music on the stand next to your device for following the Nearpod. Or, if you have two devices, especially if one is large, you can view your music as a PDF on the larger device while using your smaller device to run the video. But mister, I don't have a music stand. This is not ideal, but it'll do. And it works with just about any instrument except for flute or tuba. Now if you happen to have an actual laptop computer with a keyboard, even one that doesn't work, you can use it like this and it'll work as a stand for you. However, if your laptop does work, you have an even better option, and this option works on a normal computer as well. On an actual computer, not a tablet or a phone, you can open two separate browser windows. The larger browser window can have the music in the PDF that you downloaded. The smaller window off to the side, you can put the Nearpod lesson, and then run them side by side on the same screen. And just so you know, I can't stop you from playing like this. Just understand, it doesn't make you sound very good, and it's also kind of a pain in the neck. At the end of every video lesson, I tell you what to record if you're going to be recording for Seesaw. Some of you are sending me videos of the long tones. I never asked for that. That tells me you didn't watch the video lesson. If acapella is giving you the 30 second limit because you're on iOS, that's okay. Just record the first 30 seconds of the music, no big deal. And if you can't make acapella work at all, then just record your assignment in Seesaw like normal. If you need an updated code to log into Seesaw, message me on Teams or email me. Now, if you missed the first couple of weeks, that's okay. If you've fallen behind a little bit, you can get caught back up. To get caught back up, you want to start with week four. Understand we are now taking grades, and if you get confused later with how this works, you can come back to this video for a quick refresher. Contact me on Teams or email me if you have any questions. Mr. Escobar too, of course. I miss you guys.